from KETK, you're watching East Texas Live. Welcome back to East Texas Live. Joining us now is Erin Garner. She is with Keep Tyler Beautiful, and she's here to chat about a few fun events that are happening around the Rose City. Hello. Yes. Hi, how are you? I'm good. How are you doing? I'm great. Thank you for having us as of always. Of course, of course. Well, I'm happy that you're here because the weather's beautiful today, and it's it hopefully going to stay beautiful. Hopefully. As keep, long as Carson yeah, says it'll be Yeah, we can keep talking pretty. to Carson and, and uh, <laughs> bribe him. But, you know, people are wanting to be outside right now. They're wanting to go out and do stuff, mm -hmm. and you guys have a lot going on. So We do. We have a lot of stuff for people to go do this weekend. We have the Great Tyler Cleanup. That is one of Keep Tyler Beautiful's biggest events. It's going to be at Southside Park, and it's from 9 to noon on Saturday. And it's litter cleanup for the whole city, but our main location is at Southside Park. Mm -hmm. um, our pre-registration is, of course, over, but we are accepting walk-ups. We have supplies, everything you can do. And as long as supplies last, we've got t-shirts for volunteers, and we'll try and feed you. So it's a lot of fun. We also have door prizes at the end. And um, it's just a really fun way to get out and participate in the community and really help make a difference. Definitely. That's yeah. what I wanted to ask. Why do you think that it's important for community members to actually come out and take part in things like this yeah well it's a sense of responsibility I mean we live here we you know we need to have pride in our city and getting out there and making sure it's beautiful not only sets a good image mm -hmm. for the community but also you know helps keep it clean we need to take care of our earth we need to take care of our city and this is just one of the ways we can get those pollutants out of the system absolutely now you guys also have something that I I'm a big fan of is the artisan market yes so not this weekend but next weekend on April 8th and 9th Friday and Saturday the Rose City Artisan Market is going to be at the Goodman Museum and it's all things gardening so they're going to be live plants there'll be herbs we'll have people talking about different gardening topics I'll be there um, we've got a bunch of different vendors selling garden specific things and it's just a, you know a fun activity to get out and do um, if you want to come on Friday it's from 10 to 5 and then on Saturday from 10 to 4 it's free for any visitor so it's just you know if you need to get out and kind of want to do something different if you're an avid gardener whether you have a green thumb or a brown them. You are totally welcome. And where did you guys find these vendors? So we actually do a call out. We put it on Facebook, on our website, and we say, you know, hey, if you want to participate, let us know. There's a small fee to participate, but it is open to anybody who wants to come and do. We also have a lot of vendor events throughout the year. So if people want to participate in those, they can just follow us on Facebook mm -hmm. or contact us. Um, the main event um, person is Debbie Isham. She can be contacted at 903-531-1214 or visit us online at www.tylerparksandrec.com. Awesome. And before we leave, there's yeah. one more event that's happening. Yes, real quick. We have our big spring community sale at Glass Rec Center. That's going to be on the 9th, so a lot going on on the 9th. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it starts at 7 a.m. It's free for all shoppers, but if you have some things you want to sell, need to clean out the garage, the attic, it's only $20 to have a booth to sell things. Oh, wow. So it's a lot of fun, and you can contact Glass Rec Center, 903-595-7271, and you can contact them about getting set up, or again, visit us online. Now, if some people you know of course just watch this segment but maybe yes. they didn't jot everything down is there a place that they can go to get all of this information Facebook at TylerParksAndRec.com or TylerParksAndRec.com. Um, they can also visit us. We have a Twitter and a Facebook. Those are, or Twitter and a, um, Instagram. Those are at City of Tyler, Texas. And of course, they can always give us a call at our main line, 903-531-1370. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for yeah. coming on and sharing that. Thank you guys for everything you do for all the Tyler residents. Thank Lots you. of fun things coming up. So if you're looking for something to do this weekend or next, Bingo. There you go right there. <laughs> Thank we you so much. We look forward to seeing you. Of course. All right.